Live from San Francisco, it's The Cube. Hi, Jeff Rick here. We are on the ground at Cassandra Summit 2014 at the Western St. Francis in San Francisco, California. We're joined now by Clint Smith, General Counsel for Data Stacks. He's the guy uh, keeping track of everything. Great show. Yeah, I'm very excited to be here. Uh, the company has ter terrific momentum, both uh, on the open source Cassandra user base as well as enterprise customers. And we're just coming off raising a $106 million venture capital round at the company. $106 million. Yeah, it's a real war chest uh, to, to fund our continued growth of the database platform. and also opens up a lot of possibilities. Uh, one is we've made an investment in a community member, uh, InstaCluster, does uh, hosted Cassandra team out of Australia. That's the type of thing you can do when you have a war chest like we have now. So talk a little bit about that because I don't know that, a, you know, the venture capital game is not easy. Um, you know, making investments in companies, you know, a lot of them don't pan out, which is why those guys make a lot of money. At the same hand, we talk a little bit off camera that, you know, it's really about investing in the community. And when you build an ecosystem in a community, you know, good things happen. So I wonder if you can talk philosophically about, you know, what you guys are doing on that front. Yeah, as an infrastructure software player, the ecosystem is fundamental to your success. Uh, I was at MySQL and uh, we saw companies in our ecosystem like Splunk uh, become $5 billion companies today. And I remember when Splunk was five guys from Seattle with black t-shirts in our MySQL exhibit hall. So, so really to be a great infrastructure software company, you need a vibrant, dynamic uh, ecosystem. And there are a lot of ways we contribute to that ecosystem. Great code, great partnerships, and then in some cases we'll make a small investment. Yeah, and we'll be at Splunk.com for our third year, so uh, and they're still wearing the black t-shirts, by the way. Oh, it's uh, a great in, company. In, in Vegas in, in uh, next month. So I wonder if you can just give us kind of an update on, on data stacks. How big is the company? Obviously, you just put some money in the bank. Um, we've got the, kind of this international distributed conference going on here because of this distributed database. So can you give us a quick uh, kind of company update? Sure. Uh, we're 350 employees today. We'll be over 400 by the end of this calendar year. Uh, in terms of customers, over 500 customers, and a meaningful stat for us is 25 out of the Fortune 100 are using us. We're a great solution for the largest enterprises and organizations in the world who have massive data needs to manage. It has sounded like in some of the keynotes that some of the uh, key competitors or perceived key competitors are maybe falling by the wayside. Is there a little bit of consolidation and things kind of sorting themselves out? I think the market is uh, sorting out. Uh, all of us uh, serve a slightly different market. So we have respect for our colleagues at MongoDB. They have a great database for someone who's a, a, a scripting developer who wants to quickly you know, add database func functionality to their application. We're all about the enterprise. We're all about Java developers building big, scalable apps that are easy to manage. Uh, we're focused you know, really on large organizations and the enterprise, and that's very different from MongoDB. Yeah, great stuff. Well, Clint, thanks for stopping by. We just grabbed them out of the hall. That's what we like to do. Uh, I'm Jeff Frick. We're on the ground at Cassandra Summit 2014. We'll be right back with our next guest after this short break.